you're not like the dog chasing the bus, are you? And catches it, and it's like, oh my God, what am I gonna? I finally got it. What am I gonna do? But I mean, this is a big job you've got now, and and it's a daunting future. And I, I'm glad it's you, not me, obviously. But but media is difficult. Are, how are you gonna? Where is media, and what are you gonna do with this this great new shiny object you have? <laughs> well, first. Uh, it is a little bit surreal. This is a fantastic collection of assets. You know, I've been at Discovery for 16 years, and we've been, we've gone from a cable business, a U.S. cable business, to the leader internationally. We added sports, we added free to air, and we've always owned our IP. To put that together now, at a time of transition, with the great assets that John Stanky and his team have, HBO, you know, really in a leadership position in terms of quality and content. Um, Warner Brothers Television, over almost 400 shows, the, one of the biggest producers, makers of content in the world, Warner Brothers Motion Picture, uh, and CNN, uh, you know, the greatest news gathering organization and, uh, and news, the only really powerful global news force in the world. Putting that all together, um, it's really formidable. Um, and it is exciting. Uh, we've been spending a lot of time thinking about what, we, what could we be. But uh, it's coming, I think, at really the right time, because more and more, when consumers are thinking about where they want to go, they don't want to go to eight or nine different places, and they're not going to pay uh, for multiple, multiple different options. And we have, when this company comes together, this is something that John and I spent a lot of time talking about, over the broadest menu of entertainment, from kids to adults to teenagers, the greatest movie library, TV library. Uh, and we have more local content than anybody in the world, motion pictures. So we have this great entertainment menu, uh, which should keep people in, in, in the home, from the kids to the grandparents. Why would they go anywhere else? And then we're the leader in news to the left. Uh, and we're now, definitely you know, one of the leaders in the the sports. Left. Definitely. Right. The, did you say to the left? <laughs> Man, you weren't kidding. Uh, 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 um, no, that, that was an aside. I probably, Joe. Shouldn't, have, I probably shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. Um, no, so it's, it's uh, at a time of disruption, owning more IP, more diversity of IP, and being able to get on a train that's already moving, it's almost like 74 million subscribers. We have over 20 million subscribers. We have, we have very, very low churn. We've been able to spend years trying to figure out what do people like, what do they want more of. So has John uh, and Ann and Jason. And so together, I think we're going to get on this train. We're going to take it for a ride. As in the past, a, a, I really think this is a, like a, a transformative deal, obviously. But everybody else suddenly is in a position like, with the changing landscape, I don't know about streaming. How many are there going to be eventually? How much money are you going to make with that? How many? Um, it's just. It, it, does everyone else have to do have to do something? What's Comcast got to do? What's the, what's Disney got to do? What's Viacom? Do? What does everyone else have to do in this new world that you're creating? Well, I'm focused on uh, I know. what well, I need to do, do that, together with a great leadership team and the great assets that first John has first, been. But, but you mentioned two points. One is. Um, how are you going to make money? <laughs> the difference between this company and, and the, the overall fundamentals of any other media company that I, that I have seen is, you know, we see in 23 that we're going to be generating $8 billion or more in free cash flow and $15 billion in EBIT and over $50 billion in revenue. That's a real company. So you've seen a lot of volatility in the market with, okay, we got a lot of companies that are, hey, look what I have for the future. Warner Brothers Discovery has great fundamental economics. So we're going to be less than three times levered after 24 months. And here we are with $8 billion in free cash flow and growing. And on, on the right side of the company, we got HBO, we got HBO Max, we have all of our IP, we have all of our sports, the leader in sports in Europe. There's a deal that we announced yesterday right. with BT that I want to talk about. We're, we're a leader in kids, we're a leader in news, and over time, we have the money. Our, you know, one of the biggest challenges we're going to have is how do we deploy that free cash flow for growth? We're not a company balanced on, hey, in a couple of years, we're going to make some money and we're going to be okay. No, we have that balance. We got, and I think more and more the market is going to recognize and is starting to recognize, hey, this is a real company yeah. with real profits. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.